they come out here today particularly in Comidwell to learn about the glacial history of the area. It's a really fantastic example of glaciation in North Wales. In fact, it's one of the best examples that you'll see in the UK. We're following in the footsteps of Charles Darwin. He came here in the 1800s and, and really kind of announced that, that glaciation had happened here. And we bring our students out to give them an experience of what it's like to do fieldwork in North Wales and actually how they can read and interpret the landscape. So today's task is getting students to come out and to actually map the features that they see and then think about how that feeds into how glaciation happened in this area. So we're having a fantastic day today, good weather, lots of happy students. Like I say, we're only 20 minutes away from our school department, so it's easy to pop out and pop back within the day and kind of enjoy that fun experience. Today we are at Comidwell and um, we're here with Lindy York. We're studying geomorphical features uh, kind of caused by the last uh, glaciation uh, age. We're uh, in Comidwell in the lovely Welsh mountains and we're looking at the glacial movements and the terrain that's left behind. Coming out is quite an informative session. Um, we're learning about the different features, rock formations, um, things like that. Um, basically, the task is that we're going to put all of that stuff together um, and at the end then we're going to make a geomorphical map. Each day we get given a different assignment. So um, Monday we've got an essay to write up on it. Um, the uh, Tuesday I've just got a written piece that I've done then and there. Um, today it's all going to be mapping, drawing it out, so it's all different elements that come into the research and observation methods. It's amazing especially sort of uh, as you learn more about uh, how these things got here and, and uh, the different features you can almost sort of put a picture together of how he saw it and, and kind of how he sort of dawned on the ideas that he did. It's, it's been really fun to actually interact with the environment rather than just sitting there and learning about it. It's a completely different perspective and it's, I think it's a lot easier to understand when you can there, when you can go there and actually see it for yourself rather than having to kind of imagine it from a picture or a textbook. It's been absolutely awesome. Yeah, yeah, it's it's incredible. Sort of, I'm from a very beautiful place, and I was quite sort of uh, sad to leave it. And I can't imagine a better place to come. I mean, we've got all of this on our doorsteps, and uh, you can't really sort of put yourself in a better place for this degree. It's it's just magical.